Let's break down where you should be using AI and where you shouldn't be using it when it comes to making a podcast episode. I'm going to walk you through the process of creating a podcast episode and chat about how you can speed up your workflow while also considering how to keep that authenticity that your listeners love. Now, of course, you don't have to use AI. This is just to help speed up your workflow. If you like doing something, keep doing it. Okay, so the first thing, coming up with ideas. Using a tool like ChatGPT for this can help you come up with ideas that are more thorough and have cooler or more unique twists. Simply give ChatGPT things like your podcast description, your target audience outline, a couple examples of past episode topics or ideas for future episode topics, and ChatGPT will spit out a bunch more ideas for you. Next, brainstorming your episode. You wanna come up with ideas and the stuff you wanna talk about in your episode from your noggin. But of course, you can get a little help from AI. What I like to do is brainstorm everything I'd like to talk about in the episode. Put it into ChatGPT and use the prompt, this is what I want to talk about in my podcast episode about, and insert your podcast episode topic. Is there anything I am missing that would intrigue my target audience? My audience is, and then insert a bit of background on your target audience. And then paste the brainstormed ideas. This will help you fill up any content gaps that you may miss that your audience would like to hear about. Next, your outline for your episode. You can write this out yourself if you want, but what you can also do is head to ChatGPT, type, this is what I brainstormed for my podcast episode on podcast episode topic. Turn this into an outline for a however many minute podcast episode, and then insert everything you've brainstormed. This is really just going to organize your thoughts in a nice flow and give you an outline to stick to during the recording that will keep you on track. All right, you've got your episode ready. Now is when it comes to recording. Obviously, this has to be you and your unique voice. Next up, editing. So for editing, you'll want to do a mix of manual editing and AI edits. Now, one thing about podcasting is that it's so important to listen back to your raw footage. That way you can be aware of things like your filler words, your silences, any mouth sounds that you make, if you record it in a room with background noise, things like that. This will help you learn and implement for your next recording and your editing process will become easier. But the good news is, is that there is a way to get rid of this kind of stuff with AI. This tool that I'm gonna show you will give you the most AI tools to help streamline your editing process. So this is Riverside. You can record your podcast on this platform. For a walkthrough of how to do that, you can head to the video linked above. And then after you record, in the editor, you can remove silences from your episode. You can use magic audio to enhance the audio and remove background noise. This AI speaker view will switch the camera view back and forth based on who is speaking. You can also take out filler words by going through the episode transcript and deleting them from the text-based editor. They will then be taken out of the final episode. You can also design the look of your episode and add captions for accessibility. Riverside also always has more tools being released, so make sure to subscribe to this channel to be notified of those new feature releases. But that's just for editing, guys. There are a couple more features that we're gonna walk through, so let's move on. Show notes. This is something that I'm pretty sure everyone hates doing. Maybe there are some out there that love it. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, but you can have AI generate your show notes for you. Simply upload your edited podcast to Riverside using this upload button on the recordings page. Once it's uploaded, you can use this AI show notes button to have AI generate show notes from your transcript. If you recorded on Riverside, you can also do this from the recordings page. Next up, promotion. When it comes to promoting your episode, some people love it, some people hate it, but it's definitely something that needs to be done. But it can be made easier with AI. You can have AI find the most engaging clips from your recording and then you share it out. Simply press generate clips from a Riverside recording or an uploaded recording and Riverside will find the best parts of your episode and turn it into clips optimized for social media platforms. And then you can edit them to fit your brand using the editor that I showed you earlier. Now you'll have to share these out manually, but you can also use a scheduling platform like Plan to share those out simultaneously on multiple platforms. There you go, a complete breakdown of where you can and where you shouldn't use AI during your podcast recording. And surprise, it's pretty much all AI. But remember, it is a balance of speeding things up and becoming more efficient and also keeping that authenticity that your audience loves. 
Thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, make sure to hit that thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel for more content like this. My name is Bridget and I'll see you next time.